Good morning, everyone. Hope you're all having a start of a great weekend. Well, as I said yesterday, we're going to go ahead and open up. I think I got four of these. My wife got these for me yesterday for my birthday, amongst some of the other stuff you've seen over the videos in the past month. But at anyway, these uh, Tops 2020 Series 2, there's one exclusive purple parallel inside. And you see that there's 16 cards per pack, so let's go ahead and open these up. I have no idea who the hanger packs are going to be of. Let's look at the back of it there. Sorry about that. Go ahead and give you guys a chance to look at the odds, and there's all the information. I think you can get free goodies if you write tops, and there's all their licensing and social media handles and so on and so forth. And our purple parallel is of Alex Dickerson. Very nice. Go ahead and I do not have a bag designated for trash. So this could get interesting. So let's go ahead and open our first pack of the day. There you see Mike Trout on the front of the pack. Celebration of the Decades. That's a really nice insert set. We also see 2020 Top Series 2, 16 cards per pack. Here's your odds again. There's all their social media and all their licensing information there for you guys to see. Don't know who or what we're going to get in this. Hopefully something good as always, but you guys will let me know if I miss something. Always appreciate that. Dominic <laughs> Domingo Leba. Probably butchered that one. Max Fried of the Braves there, Future Stars card. And I remember way back when, especially in the mid late 80s, that Future Stars cards were cards Future Stars cards. I'll get it right here in a minute, guys. They they were always uh, those ones that people like to get because they thought these were really, really good prospects. Um, really can't think. I think Greg Jeffries might have been a Future Star in the 89 set. May have also been his rookie card. So a lot of people looked at those as rookies when they really weren't uh, based as rookies. Usually the first draft pick cards were, but ooh, there's a nice... Uh, Sean Yamaguchi of the Blue Jays. I don't know if that's a variation or not. Let's flip it over and see. Doesn't look like it, but my camera's being a little bit of a bear right now. Don't think it is, but we'll 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 investigate that later. And we have uh, Homer Bailey, the Twins there. Jose Abreu, Brandon Lau. Or is it Brandon Lowe? I don't know. It's another Future Stars card. Luke Weaver. Ooh, Tucker Barnhart Gold. Very nice. What's that one numbered to? 1396. So we'll set that one aside. Kind of like that one. Have to get that one sleeved up here shortly. Reggie Jackson, Turkey Red. Set that one aside. And Charlie Blackman. And we end with Logan Webb. So we'll go to this hanger pack. I don't know what you'd actually call these. I mean, they're obviously a retail exclusive of, of some kind. I don't think that they are specifically limited to just Walmart or Target or Meyer. And I need to... Should have brought something in here to cut these with. I'm trying to do this without bending the, the our purple parallel which is Chris Bassett of the Oakland Athletics. Set that one aside, and we'll go ahead and rip open pack number two here. Does not feel thicker than the other one. Can't feel slightly thicker, but I don't think there's any relics in there. But we will see what we get. Justin Dunn of the Mariners, rookie card there. Who do we have here? Uh, alumni, okay, I'm not even going to try that first name. Harrison Bader. Byron Buxton. James Marvel. As I have notifications popping up on my screen. Yandy Diaz. Stephen Baralt. Christian Walker. Walker Bueller. That's nice. You have a last name and a first name back to back. Rick Porticello, who 
is that Elvis Luciano, some kind of a parallel there. Another uh, Solar, who is that? Jorge Solar. Flaherty with St. Louis. Jack Flaherty, look on the back there. Mike Fulton, no Swiskets, okay. And Scott Oberg. So definitely some names in there that I could not pronounce. Maybe pack number three will be a little easier on the vocal skills. But we'll find out here in just a minute. Get this pack ripped open. And our purple parallel is of David Robertson of the Phillies. So the exclusive purple parallels have not been that great. Maybe pack number four will be the big one. Maybe it'll be uh, Mike Trout or Bo Bichette or some other higher end player. Start with Alex Cobb. Starts off pack number three. Of course, I know I'm going to have a few of these horizontally oriented cards. Cincinnati Reds, San Francisco Giants. Those seem to be back-to-back -back, revved up. Seemed like I had this pack before. Jake Cave, Margot, Tony Canal, Thornback, Rick Porticello, or Porticello, we just had him in the last pack. Brandon Nimmo, Ozzy Albies, Austin Slater, and a nice Chris Bryant, 85 All-Star throwback. Then we have Stan Musial, Stan the Man Musial, Steve Wilkerson, and Brian Bundy. I'll throw that Stan the Man and that uh, Chris Bryan over there. I know that I had another turkey red in that second pack, but it wasn't ringing a bell with me to throw it over there. There we go. Now we don't need, don't need assistance. And our last one is San Diego's Padres team card with Fernando Tatis Jr. there. Very nice. So our last pack. These all felt pretty thick, but I do not think that it's... Uh, I do not see a thick card in there. I cannot get it to focus because it's uh, trying to focus on the stuff in the background. But be that as it may, we'll put these cards up here. Almedes... Almedes... <laughs> Oh, well, I will get there with pronunciation on some of these someday. Harrison Bader just had some of these guys in the previous pack. Garrett Hampton, Eddie Rosario. So it looks like we got a few repeats here. We did not have Noah Sendergaard. Rick Porter with his third. He's been in three of the four packs. This guy's been in two of the packs. So Topshire Coalition is... Uh, not the greatest. Ty Cobb. Was that a was that a parallel? No. Don't think it was. Lopez and our final card is Colby Allard. I'm trying to see what that little thing is. Memorial Stadium there at the bottom. So we got our our four purple parallels. I really like that Padres team card. We'll put that one, put the four purple parallels together. I know some people have interest in those. Really like that Reggie Jackson, that Tucker Barnhart. That's a nice one. Of course, we had that Ty Cobb, Chris Bryan All Star, and the Stand the Man Usual. So anyway, hope you guys enjoyed those packs. I did. Certainly had some nice looking stuff in it. But anyway, yesterday when me and my wife was at Meyer, I picked up a couple of things. I got a couple of these hanger packs of the 2020 Donruss Elite Football. And one blaster box of 2020 Donruss Elite Football. And on average, there's one auto or mem in each box. So kind of excited to open these. I haven't opened any of these yet this year. So we will open one of these things later this afternoon. Not exactly sure which one. But we will open one of them. And uh, I don't know. Maybe we'll do that. Maybe we'll do that blaster box first. We'll do that blaster box first to see who the auto or mem is that we get. But uh, we're at 160 subs. Appreciate all the uh, support you guys are giving me on our way to 500, our journey to 500. So when we get to 500, as you guys know, we will do another giveaway and we will be doing a relic giveaway. It'll either be 
It will be a choice of a football, a baseball, a racing, or a wrestling relic. So when we get there, hopefully you will be the lucky subscriber once we have our contest. And you can walk away with one of the four relic cards that will eventually make their way to those easels in the back. I've just got to go through, <clears throat> excuse me, i got a couple boxes of cards I need to go through and pick out the relics that I think that will make the contest fun. So once again, thank you guys for your support. Keep those likes coming, keep those comments coming keep the subscriptions coming. I truly do appreciate it. And come back and see us later this afternoon. We're going to go ahead and open up this blaster box this evening and see what we get. So thank you guys for watching and enjoy the rest of your Saturday.